Hi, this is Rizwana. I'm from Marketing Magazine Singapore. We are here today with the CEO of Social Bakers, Yan Rezab. Thank you for joining us and making the time. What is the value proposition and USB of Social Bakers as an analytics platform? So we, we position ourselves as the, as the key competitive monitoring tool in, in social media analytics. So we would help a company uh, optimize themselves and also compare it to its competitors. What are, you know, it's important for every company to know what are my competitors doing? Mm -hmm. How is my industry doing? So if I'm in the fashion industry, I, I really want to know how the other companies in fashion industry perform. So if I, unless I know that, I can't really do social marketing properly. So our tools introduced in that mix is competitive monitoring, and we're, we're the, the biggest company doing that. We're providing it for over 1,300 companies around the world, and it's, um, it's been a great ride for the last four years. What is the objective of your world tour, and why did you choose Singapore as one of your destinations for this Asian cities tour? So Singapore is a, is a critical, critical destination on our world tour. Uh, on our world tour, we're, we're doing 10 different cities all around the world. In almost all cases, it's where we have offices. We, we have our local offices with our local representatives. In Singapore, we don't have that yet. We, uh, we travel here, but we are opening an office right now. We're in the process of opening and hiring the team here. So Singapore's always been a key Asian destination in terms of marketers. So it's, that's why we chose Singapore. What are your, some of your plans in Asia and in Singapore in particular? Asia is one of our biggest markets in terms of numbers of customers and we're trying to grow the revenue base. We have uh, some of Asia's largest customers, our customers such as Samsung and uh, many, many others. So our goal is to grow that customer base, help them understand and better themselves in social media. What do you find is unique to the Singapore market and how do you think it varies from the other markets in your tour? I think that um, as, as a lot of the Asian markets, it has a very high uh, amount of cultural diversity. You have a lot of expats, but you have a lot of local marketers. So it's, um, it's a very unique market, and you have to approach it that way. You have to be on the ground. And also the time difference from, uh, from Europe or the U.S. is pretty heavy. So that's mm -hmm. why you have to really be here on the ground. Can you share a little bit more about the socially devoted metric and how does it impact businesses? So socially devoted is, is a standard of how to do social customer service. Um, if a person asks on your Facebook page or your Twitter profile, a user expects a response mm -hmm. and naturally expects that he will get a response from the company. And the companies have been adapting more and more to that. And we're saying that the companies should respond almost all of questions posed on their social media profiles, mm -hmm. that they should really go and, and answer in a timely manner, and that they should not be closed in social media, be open on, in what they're doing and how they're, how they're doing things. So that's what Socially Devoted is about, and we're measuring if companies are, are doing that well or not doing that well. Can you share a little bit more about the Brand Love application, and what does it do, and how does it add value to your customer research? So for us in, in the Social Bakers platform, it was always around providing competitive quantitative intelligence. So understanding, okay, this, this post work, this post doesn't work, uh, these things work for my competitors, these things don't work for my competitors. And as you understand that, it's more important to also understand the qualitative metrics. So what do people actually think? Do my fans like me more than my non-fans? Mm -hmm. Or is it the other way around? So. Mm -hmm. What is it? Who is my fan base consistent about, and how much do they like me? So that's why built the brand. That's why we built the brand love application to help companies understand it with that.